guys, girls, and everyone else who is watching me. Or better yet, peeps. <laughs> Eventually I'll change my uh, YouTube banner. You know, the, uh, the main thing that says welcome to, uh, Celine Darken channel. Eventually, I will update that. Because right now, yeah, I have Final Fantasy 9, Nell, and 1, 2, 3, 4 of my art pieces. Up. But I do want to update it to probably just something a big picture that I drawn with uh, the text add to it. I don't know. What the freaking? Oh, that's a big. You know, I never found Momo's uh, first uh, dress spear. And that's probably due to the fact that I don't use her. Wait, are you saying uh, this is the four? I'm confused because I do not think this is the four gnosis. Revealed my ancient powers to me. Well, your ancient powers are. I don't know. I actually did not mean for it to go on that long. Which is that? Get out of my way, or else... Well, it doesn't matter, it's dead. You guys are probably getting tired of seeing this already. But I'm sorry, if there's a way to make the game easy, I'm gonna use it. And if I knew this was uh, a way to cheese, cheese it, I would have used it back then. No, I mean, serious. If I actually knew uh, this was possible back when I originally was playing it, as it was coming out, I would have used this, this strategy then too. Mother F, what the H are you? I know they're all noses, but sheesh. Wait, is this the trials? Are you saying this is the, the sin of trials? Oh, you can return up. And, uh. 
Use a save point. Hello, goodbye. Nice knowing you. Nope. Don't need the doors no more. Oh, sorry. I heard, I was listening to it. And I was like, wait, okay. I'm tired of Kale's looking up. Alright, let's get over here and wait for the next one to show up. Oh, it's just that one. We already seen one of you. Don't care anymore. I think it just ran at me. Wait, did you just heal me? I forgot to hit X. Dude, I have no idea what you just did. No, I'm not fighting the battle legitimately. I'm going when it's she on start, I'm summoning the robot. You know, I still don't know what that does. Reverse. Oh, well, doesn't matter. Goodbye. Well, she has up to 40. Okay, uh, looking at the albedo images, Shion is higher than what she should be, which is good. Uh, I think Cosmo should be 40, because her health should be higher. And Junior, they have Junior in the picture. But I'm not using Junior, so. Huh, I'll be able to text like, as fast as a rapid dog. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Now, you can ride it back up and use the bio spear. Huh, I can use it twice now.
saving. Because now we got four more. But now I can do two battles without healing her magic. Which is actually good. I forgot when you're with your C3, you can't do it. So. Health recovery. Slow. I'm sorry, if they did not affect you to use the robot this much, they wouldn't have given it to you. Until the very... Oh, wait, this is the very end. Eh. No, yeah, sure you did. No, no, I'm just getting them. Just to get them. Hmm. Let's see. I cannot have, uh, okay. I can almost evolve that one. I can evolve this one, though. Light and wings. What is light and wings? Attack and clear all status. Well, I want that then. Because that seems awesome. Okay, fight the next two. Ow. Ow. Goodbye. I wonder if that's actually a hint of what who she truly is. 
Or who she's the reincarnation of, better yet. Because she's an actual reincarnation of a character. As Chaos is just old. Yeah, a big hit. Chaos is old. And I mean, Chaos is old. They don't know how old he truly is. Because they just found him one day. But that's episode two. And onward. Which I just noticed, I haven't been getting any form of copyright. Uh, I mean, Sony does not give me copyrights. They say, hey, this is owned by, this was done by uh, such and such. It's like, okay. But they never, uh, they say it's fair use. Unlike other companies we know. This is why I love, and I do mean love, uh, for Onyx. Alright, get ready for cutscenes. Or not. Ah, there we go. I'll be able to question your your outfit. Well then, what shall we do now? Shall we continue where we left off? What is that? Are, are you how are you doing that? Don't be so surprised. This is the power of will. A fundamental power that exists within everyone. What you are witnessing is simply your perception of it. And you know what? Perception and pain are but one and the same. So, go ahead. Feel my pain for yourself. Hmm. Oh, for that? Say hello to him. Now, I don't know if it goes straight into the next part. But, we'll find out. Okay, you're taking too long. I'm sorry, I'm impatient. <laughs> okay, this does count as in. So we should be able to use it in the next uh battle. Cuz I get two uses. Answer me. Why are you doing this? There's absolutely nothing you can hope to gain out of this. Ah, oh, Contrera. I am doing all this for your sake, Rubido. For my sake? Have you forgotten, Rubido? That fateful day 14 years ago? Have you forgotten what you did to us? It's all because of you. Because you closed yourself off from us. Our mental link was broken. And one after another, we succumbed to the power of the song. Left behind that horror. 
Do we have any choice but to submit to it? Remember what happened, and repent for your sin. It's true, I... I mean... <laughs> so you finally admit to it, you coward. All right, damn it. I couldn't control my fear. Jane. Yes. Therefore, you must atone for your sins. Atone with your life. I am the executor for all those who were destroyed. Although, I'm actually grateful to you, Brunhilde. Thanks to you, I alone was able to find the way. The way to a whole new world. What do you mean, a whole new world? That's all that I see. It's quite simple. What the hell are you talking about? I just... I don't know. <laughs> At first, I wasn't sure if I should believe. But I experienced something a moment ago that confirmed it. And this ought to verify that experience for me. <laughs> Entertain me if you will. First destroy this in order to stop the proto Merkava. You do realize that oh almost forgot the time. <laughs> Not much left now. I'd say five minutes at best. I wonder how far you'll get in your current condition. <laughs> Oh yeah, this is the final battle. This is no ordinary force. Everyone, be careful. You think? Okay, it says the first round focus on healing. Oh, thank God. Good. That's all this round is. It's just healing. Then it says, uh. Ooh.
I'm gonna start boosting Cosmos. I'm gonna send it straight to the third stage with this. I didn't let it finish, so this time I'll let it finish. And yes, this video is gonna be very long because I'm gonna just beat the game. And that means the ending cutscene too. <laughs> This is screams, um, Power Rangers. And yes, I'm drinking my last soda, so I can't constantly bring the bottle up to here. Knocked his health way down, Lou. Ah, uh, you can get the second one. this truck killing next round Well, now it's going to go boom. And you already seen that once. Stuff the struck. Okay. Bye. I guess this would be the third stage. Yeah, I'm trying to, uh, 
Okay, everyone. Boost up. But I'm gonna need to use his. Not what I thought it would do. If you're just gonna be nice enough to do that. Charging. Yeah, I thought it would be nice. We beat the game. Literally, we just beat the game. Which is really shocking. Continue at present speed, it will enter the atmosphere in approximately eight minutes. Looks like we planned this from the very beginning. Curse it! Got too many tricks up his sleeve! We have to do something. If something as large as this impacts at full speed, the second mission will be. Based on the current angle of approach, breaking up the facility into approximately 28,000 pieces will result in 99.6% of them vaporizing before impact. If we detach each subcompartment, just a second. I'll search through my memory banks. Control room. The control room on level 33 will allow us to detach the facility. Hurry, there's no time.
Is this the only place we can activate it from? We can't do it remotely? No! The system was built so that the command will only be accepted from here. Dang it. So the only way to stop this thing is to go down with it? This can't be. There has to be another way. to the Elsa with the others. I will stay behind to initiate the detachment sequence. Wait a second. Stay behind? This facility will enter the atmosphere shortly. We will exceed the tolerances for maximum temperature in 3 minutes 28 seconds. Please hurry. But... My self-preservation programming is functioning properly. I have no intention of remaining on this facility to the very end. Do not worry. At maximum speed, I can reach the Elsa in under one minute. You're sure? Yes. This option guarantees the highest probability of success. All right. Let's go, Shion. But... Trust me. It'll be okay. She'll catch up. Now come on. Shion? Shion. I love this song. This is my favorite song. So I'm gonna mute the mic so you can listen to it and make my video disappear.
Wait, relinquish your pain. To me, the aft hatch is open. What? Who's tomorrow doing that? Is he trying to burn all of us from the inside out? It can't be.
Spectre! Hmm? Activate the secondary bow camera. Roger. Okay. This song is actually called Pain. And it's Cosmos' theme song, I think. And it's my most favorite song in this entire world. Uh, according to the book, a lot of things are going to fill out. A lot of the stories, plot holes are going to be filled out during the credits. That is Jin, Jian's brother. He's going to be our... He's going to be a playable character in 2 and onward. In fact, part 2 picks up right after they land. And it, did you notice here in the kind of scene, her eyes, that quote she said to Chaos, that shut him up? That was actually uh, a certain character that's linked to him. But yeah. There's a vortex of temptation, an obsession that still remains. That's what continues to draw them in. Oh, and some answers live before you. Just the same. And Our some. Leader? You mean the UIC Alito? He's still alive? He will not die. <laughs> Oh. Okay, I get that point. Okay. There's some uh, mysteries here only be revealed during the credits. However, the credits are not going to fill everything. Like, who's the blue hair personality that's inside Cosmos? Uh, there's credits. Are you saw the subtitles? That's not that worried about what Albedo said. Who's the blue ha blue eyed personality? We've confirmed a gate jump by Albedo's craft. This is acceptable. Yes, that's fine. The door that leads to Abel's car. He is the only one who can open it. There's a possibility. doesn't have that much power. There's only a key. Of course, we must accept the possibility that he can affect space and time anomalies to some extent. But that's what all of you are for. Still, his will shines with such wondrous light. It's a shame to relegate him to such a minor Okay, Wilhelm's the main um, bad guy, I think. They never confirmed that. At least I don't remember it, them confirming it. But there's something up with, with uh, Xion's head of the boss. She does act, believe it or not, there's something wrong. There's something up with the, the head. And yes, she was damaged a little bit, like her helmet, but she gets a whole new body in part two. 
I mean, literally, she gets a whole new body in all three, in the other two games. She's the one that changes the most. I mean, yeah, Junior changes clothes. Xion changes clothes. Yeah, everyone changes clothes. But she changes bodies. Nikki stays the same, though. I love this song. I love, love, love this song. But, uh, that is the end of Genosaga Episode 1. I absolutely love the Genosaga series. Or the saga. That's what they're calling it. And, yes, I know, I didn't do certain things right and whatnot. Now it's going to prompt me to save after To Be Continued. Would you save the data? Yes, I want to save the game. Yes, I want to save the game. Because what's going to happen is Toon's going to ask for this, uh, ask for this save. To, uh, carry over. Well, it's not going to carry over levels or anything. But we're going to get, uh, bonus items and such. And I think money. But money's not the issue because I'm going to use the money cheat. But, yeah, we have beaten Genosaga Episode 1. My thoughts on this game? I have no problems with it. I love Genosaga. I really do. Juno Saga episode one, two. Episode uh two is my favorite of the three. Cause I don't like what happens in three, but three is also the most advanced. And has more death in it than two and one. But nonetheless, I love the Juno Saga series. All three games, I love them. Yes, I hate Momo in this game, but in 2 and 3, she gets better, to the point she's usable. Uh, now, the only thing that I know for a fact that changes in episode 2, Junior still uses guns, uh, Cosmos, no, Cosmos is still her usual self. Siggy, I'm pretty sure he still uses his fist and feet. He's a cyber. He doesn't change. Uh, Junior's still guns. I think, uh, Xion still uses that, that weird tool. But it gets a different model. Uh, Chaos uses gloves. He's technically using his magic. But, but did you notice the wings that Cosmos had? No, those were from Chaos. Chaos was leading her, his powers to protect everyone. Because, uh, that little girl, Nephilim, literally asked Chaos multiple times, is he sure he wants to do this? Because Chaos... It's technically not supposed to interfere. Because my theory is he's an, he's an actual angel. He's, or maybe a fallen god. I don't know. I'm playing on the, with his powers. I want to say he's more angelish, Like the one of the archangels. But I'm not really sure. They're going to mention his uh, original name. Or at least the past name that he used. In episode two and three. Um. But I can tell you right now. In episode two. And onward. Everyone's going to have a buddy. Like Shion's always going to be paired up with, with Cosmos. No matter what. Because her and Cosmos has this bond. Unbreakable bond. That no one can break. And it has nothing to do with the fact she helped build Cosmos. It has to do with the entity, the second personality inside Cosmos, her 
and who she on the reincarnation of. They actually hint at that in episode two. Because they keep calling, they'll start calling her uh, a certain name. Uh, let's see. Junior and Chaos will be a pair. Not a love pair or anything. I'm not really sure why Chaos sticks to Junior, but they stick together. Momo and uh, Ziggy stick together because the father-daughter bond they have. Jen's the only one who doesn't have a partner. To tell you the truth. Because everyone's going to get their own mobile suit. Uh, Junior's going to get Asher. Or... Yeah, Asher. Momo's gonna get a, her own pink one that Siggy Copala's in. Junior and Chaos do, they pilot Asher. Uh, Shield and Cosmos pilots another mobile suit. Yes, I know they're called something else, but I call them mobile suits because that's what they are to me, at least. And I'm really in the mix, so. Uh, I think Jin actually is the only one who can pilot. He has his own Chinese, Japanese style, uh, greenish, uh, mech. He uses swords and everything. <laughs> It's really neat. I like using his. But, um, I don't know who co is it. Sometimes it's a new character that's going to be introduced into, uh, Kanan. His name is Kanan. I love him. He's a realian. I'm not, that's all I'm going to tell you about him. But he's introduced into, and he, uh, sometimes Copa's, uh, uh, Jin's mobile suit. So, yeah, in part two, there's going to be a total of four, uh, mobile suits that we'll have in battle. Plus, they're going to introduce, uh, team-ups. They're a little dull, they're team, they're a little, uh, weird team, or little weird attacks that two people can it's two to three people that can do it um uh, everyone has at least a few a few of them with different characters like uh Momo's and Cosmos heals everyone I don't know why but it heals and attacks at least I think so. I would have to get the book and read up on what they each do. But I'm going to do that when we actually get to two. But. My thoughts on this game. Back to this game. It's all good. And everything. What I really wish. Yeah, I was going to throw this back to this. What I really wish is that the song in Nephla part, that was the hardest part of the game. I wish they would have changed it where the PM, the, the last area we're in, is going to start doing this. I don't care. I'm going to turn off the sound though so you can hear me talk. I wish they leveled it better. You know how uh, the first few areas started out easy and slowly getting difficult over time? It leveled up as it got harder as you you got leveled. I kind of wish it did the same thing with the the song of Nephla. Which is really weird because her name is the same name as the song. But, uh... I don't understand why that one place... 
was the hardest of all the places on this game. I kind of wish they leveled it better so it wasn't so difficult. I kind of wish they made it so what we just went through was the hardest part. But no, that was actually the easiest. The easiest. And don't tell me it's because I got the robot. Because no, the robot, yeah, sure, it made it easy. But half of them I was fighting le legit. The mechs, I was fighting legit. Unless it got, until it got bullshit. And then I was like, nah, no. Nope. <laughs> but yeah. I mean, other than that nitpick I have, I have no problems with this game. I kind of wish they uh, put Momo as a bow at the start of the game and not had her do this wand bullshit. And for her first wand, I don't know where it was or anything. Because let me get the book up. Out again. Uh, I don't care. Don't care. Let's see. Where do I get? Okay. Got Momo. The section where I get her. Uh. That's still the section where I got her. This is Momo. Okay. This is the. Okay. This is the weird ship. Did it have anything? Magic hat. Oh. I did miss it. It's on the... Catacol ship? The, the Gnosis ship. It's on the Gnosis ship. I did miss it. Well, freak. I ain't going back to get it. H, no. Because my other save point, I don't have Momo. So, I wouldn't go... I can't get it anyway. And I'm like, that's suicidal to go get her. And, the, and then go there. Oh, hey, you don't know. But, uh... Yeah. Genosaga episode one. It's complete. Uh, for... I actually don't know... Where this could apply. Or, I don't know where this video is going to sit. Uh, I'll do a blog video after this. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. Leave me a like, comment, subscribe if you haven't. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye! <laughs>